hey friends uh, today we are going to see about uh, perform performance monitor so basically what is performance monitor or perform it is a basically a tool administrative tool by which uh, you know you can monitor the performance of the server uh, in real time so there are some issues uh, with the application and they are saying that uh, you know uh, the process is too high but uh, your monitoring system doesn't raise alert and you want to really check uh, what's happening then you can use perf one to do a real time monitoring of uh, various performance parameters of the server to get a better understanding on what's happening so today we will see about uh, perf one to open perf one click start administrative tools scroll down you can see performance monitor so this will open the performance for you or performance monitor so click on uh, performance monitor and uh, you can see uh, in real time the data you can add various counters here uh, various performance counters that you want to you know monitor and uh, them here so here uh, it's showing the processor time total and uh, it's around uh, you can see the values here what was the last value average value what was the maximum uh, you know duration it went maximum it went uh, to nine percent to add a new counter uh, just have to click add Uh, let's say you want to add a memory counter uh, then scroll up click here and then I, um, I want to see available megabytes So now you can see that counter has got added uh, here. But this is not a percentage counter available megabytes. So you can always see the value at uh, 359. So it's 1 GB uh, you know, system. So in that 360 uh, MB is used. If you want to change the scale of the chart, uh, go to properties. Or you can just uncheck this. I think it should. Go to properties. Scale is one, I think. We need to make the scale hundred. Now go to properties. I'm sorry, I chose the wrong counter for this game. Multiplying, see what mistake. And again, maximum is 100 as given, so to give it 1000. Now if I say like available memory
okay i think i made a mistake in the scale so okay, the scale should be one now it should uh, show us the counter exactly so that was a mistake from my side so you should always leave the scale at one and uh, here you have to give how much is the maximum memory and uh, you can see the value in real time if you want to see the processor again the scale varies so you have to uh, change it uh, okay now you have 100 so it should be one so you can see the excel value Uh, if you want to uh, don't want to monitor let's say your issue is happening every day at a particular time in night then uh, you want to schedule something then you have to use the data collections in that case can come here and add the schedule uh, let me show it from start how to create a new data collection so let me go new data collection set uh, daily at, at 2 a.m. I want uh, the basic parameters to be captured so click next so we can see various templates are there uh, so active directory template will have active directory related counters basic template will have all the windows basic counters system diagnostics will have system correlated counters and system performance will generate a report delay status of local hardware resource system response time process on the local computer identification so for this uh, we'll just create a basic one and click finish so i want to schedule this to run every day at uh, night 2 pm because i won't be in office so i go to schedule click add uh, run all days start time is 2 a.m. you can give expiry and date or expiration date also like you want to do it for a week click ok what is the stop condition you want you can mention the values here click apply and click ok and this will create a daily performance uh, counter which runs every day at particular time if you want to immediately run it uh, you just have to click uh, run and this will start running the this counter immediately uh, give it a couple of seconds and click stop so the report would have been created you have to go to report you set define and daily to aim and you can see the report got created you can see the summary what the cpu was and you can see the details of each one cpu what processes were running how much it was capturing what services were running it will give you a nice snapshot of everything hope it has been useful for you and thank you for watching